What's up, guys? So today I only played uh, two stocks. The first one, um, AMAT, I think it's called Applied uh, Materials. Uh, so here, uh, I went long. So opening range breakout. So it's a huge breakout at uh, 9.30, uh, 9.35. Uh, it looked like it was gonna go break up above. So basically, there's this level here at around 36.91. Thought it was gonna go up, went long, um, and then it dropped on me. So I got stopped out, um, but then it popped back up. So it went long again, added to my position, and then when it popped, I soaked. And then here, um, it has this big drop so I went short um, and then I immediately got stopped out okay um, waited a bit and then it consolidated held this level so I went long again it popped and then I sold so uh, $91 um, it's a very strong stock um, but I'm proud of myself for stopping out early um, and for recognizing um, when um, the stock was strong. Um, I didn't want to go, um, so when I went short, um, this thinking that because of this huge uh, engulfing pattern, it didn't happen. Um, so um, I'm just, yeah, this is just good trading, and yeah, you know, the way I view it, um, just because I I um, kept my losses really short because. If I didn't get stopped out here when I went short, it could have popped up like this. I don't want to hold it through that. So uh, for me, I'm kind of proud of myself for uh, for doing that. Um, and also, the reason why I went short too is if you look at the five minute here. Um, it didn't form a new five minute high. So um, I was thinking it would do a reversal, uh, but it was strong, so I got stopped out. It is what it is. Um, and then for TXT, um, I'm also, well, I'm ambivalent about how I did it with this stock. So this stock was actually fairly versatile. So I took small sizes, uh, 500 shares, um, and I went short, but as you can see here, it popped up. Now, what I did here was I added to my position at the top here. Um, so in a way, this is sort of averaging uh, down, uh, which is not advisable. But the reason why I did this is if you look at all the candlesticks here, um, they are, this stock is very vers uh, volatile and it was basically uh, moving up and down. Look, this is a 50 cent um, basically range right here for that one minute. Uh, something similar happens here, right? From what, 52.81 to 52.45 so that's another 30 40 cent move so basically what happened here was when it popped up every time when it made a move to the extreme it would basically bounce back so I was actually quite uh, confident in the fact that it would uh, drop again so um, when I went short it did not it popped up and held this level because at first I thought it was going to uh, continue to uh, move down simply because on the five minute you see this is a strong engulfing pattern here is sort of an indecision doji but this was very strong so i thought it was going to continue to move downwards um especially if it would break this level um i was hoping it would continue to fall but it did not happen it popped up but i was confident enough that it would uh you know display the same amount of uh volatility so went heavy I think this is 500 shares added to my position a do, uh, for a total of a thousand here, I think, or 1500. I, I don't know. Uh, and when I dropped, I quickly sold because, like I said, it was pretty uh, volatile. So once it dropped, I started to uh, scale up rather quickly. So um, I kind of repeated the same thing here. Um, so. Again, the reason why I went short here is because I see that the um, 9 EMA crossed the, uh, I think this is the 50 SMA. So uh, there's no other levels below that. So I, th I was thinking that this would continue to fall. It did not. Um, and then all of a sudden, I kind of held it through this because I want to see if it will pop up above here um, to, to, 
to be stopped out. Uh, unfortunately, it, when it popped up here, it all of a sudden just ran up really quickly. Um, but looking at all the candlesticks previously, um, it was volatile, so I went short again, this time 2,000 shares. Um, so this is the part where it's a little iffy for, for me, um, because like I said, when you don't want to do a lot of averaging down because that's not good trading, but at the same time, um, you, you sort of have to know um, how the stock is behaving, and this stock was very uh, volatile today. So I had a feeling it was gonna go drop, um, and I almost stopped myself out at this point because once I went short here at this level and it popped, um, I was gonna get out, but like I said, this is just very volatile like this. So um, I was just waiting and seeing um, what it would do, and then it, it did drop, and once it did, I basically covered really quickly for uh, 133 uh, dollars. So um, overall, uh, 224 uh, bucks off of uh, 24 tickets and uh, about 45.39 in uh, commission. So um, that's that. Uh, so in a way, I'm proud of myself for recognizing uh, the behavior of this stock that it was choppy, and I basically played it according to the behavior. But then, um, not too proud of you know doing the uh, averaging down, um, so to speak. So, um, you know, I guess I have to see uh, further whether um, whether this is uh, uh, good in terms of being adjusting the uh, trading pattern and trading strategy to the uh, Situation or whether this is a bad habit. I'll try not to do this uh, often um, But again, you have to be uh, fluid in your approach. So um, I'm ambivalent on this Anyway, hope everyone did well um, See you soon